Hi guys, welcome to Vlogmas Day 9. It's a Monday morning and I'm not feeling the best. I woke up from a kind of bad dream. I have cramp. I already know it like it's a Monday, so I mean we're starting off horribly and I was gonna be sarcastic then and say we're starting off great, but I was like no, like we're just not even gonna do that. But yeah, see you soon. Oh, and wish me luck. <laughs> Hi guys, so I have actually had dinner. So it's kind of late, it's like the evening. I didn't just get in from school or anything. Um, and school was once again horrible. I really didn't like school today. I nearly cried a couple times again. It was just not great. And I'm just so unhappy with it. But I'm not, I like, I don't really want to keep on talking about how I'm not happy with it because I just feel like it's the same old thing. But what I do want to talk about is the fact that there was good things that happened today. And I made sure that right from the beginning of the day, I took note of little things that I could appreciate, which accounted for a good day, you know? It wasn't a good day, but like, when you add them all up, <clears throat> when you add all the little things up, it just, there's a lot of them that are good. So, the choices on the radio, <laughs> um, walking my dog, the fact that in my German speaking lesson it wasn't that bad, she brought us food, which was awesome, and the fact that in my advent calendar I got hand food which I wanted so bad so this is just a hand cream and listen to this it is a hydrating hand cream with shea butter macadamia oil and marshmallow it is scented with sweet lime and vanilla that just sounds like the best thing ever and my mum was intrigued too <laughs> hi and seeing hi and was great as always um lee hugging me was awesome so guys i actually have made the decision because it is a little bit hard to vlog on school days when i actually have to go to school and um i feel like because i'm sad a lot of the time at school and then when i get home i'm a little bit sad because i just had a bad day i don't want to like constantly be saying the same thing to you guys all the time i'm still gonna update you on how i feel though because i want to be transparent with you but um i'm really excited because i break up on thursday on friday sorry but i am going to make this vlog be from monday to friday because i want to upload that on sunday and then on saturday i'm gonna upload day seven and eight because I actually have a couple of things this week that I'm kind of anxious about and I don't want to like constantly be like you need to edit this video by this time you need to get it up on this day I just want to give myself some peace because I feel like it's just too much pressure when I'm already anxious about things it's just not a great combination so that's what I'm feeling right now I'm kind of going to sign off for the night what I'm going to do is I I'm currently going to try to finish my book after you. I've been literally reading it for months. I just keep not really, either not getting time to read it or just reading it, but just reading it really slowly because I'm not like into it enough at the time or I'm not getting a long enough period of time to really get into it. But I'm going to read that. And I'm just going to do some other like winding down things. I might do a little bit of homework because I do want to get that out of the way. But I'm going to chill tonight and I'm also going to watch the stars. Also the moon is so big today and that makes me so happy because I've said this before but in case you didn't know, I love the moon <laughs> so much. The moon is my favourite thing. I just love it. When I live on my own, oh my god my uni dorm, in my uni dorm I should have a moon tapestry. Perfect thing. I really want to have something of the moon everywhere. I don't really want like little moon jewelry necessarily because I feel like that's kind of the very generic thing to do. It's very pretty, but like I like to do things that are more personal to me. So, I mean, I know a tapestry, like a lot of people might have a tapestry, but I've never seen someone have a moon tapestry. And I'd love to have that just in my uni dorm, not in like my proper house or anything. But 
yeah anyway that got really sidetracked but yeah i'm just gonna chill i hope you're all doing well um oh yeah something else that's good that happened today is that i talked to my family friend ollie he is one of the loveliest people that i know and it was actually because i was having like a hard time feeling insecure in my friendships and everything that I reached out to him I was just like look like I'm having a hard time right now like you're such a genuine person like I hope you're doing well and like how are you you know hey like how are you <laughs> and yeah he was really sympathetic he was really nice we had a, like a little catch up which was really nice to do every once in a while and Parissa also shout out to you because um she really helped me realize that anybody who is so basically in a couple of vlogs ago I was talking about how I felt alone because I felt like people weren't going to appreciate me because um, I don't want to do drugs and stuff and I felt like people were going to get tired of me or find me boring. But she made a point to me today which I did already know but like when she said it I was just like that is true. Like thank you for reminding me of that because she basically said that anybody who's your true friend is going to appreciate you for who you are and I was just like yeah you know anybody who doesn't want me for who I am like I don't want them anyway why would I want to spend time with people who don't want me like that's going to be a bit boring and awkward so like you know <laughs> okay right guys I'm actually going to go chill now <laughs> hey guys welcome to vlogmas day 10 it is currently Tuesday and I'm just about to open my advent calendar so I didn't do this on my vlog yesterday, but I'm going to do it on the vlog today because it's the big 10, which is really big. So let's go. Oh, yay. <laughs> oh, they're really hard to get out. So it is a bright and beautiful radiance boosting mask with white flower, lotus flower, Cherry Blossom, Rooibos Tea Extract, and Vitamin C. Yes, so it is going to make you all shiny. Let me update you guys on my day. So, I've just been at school. It's been a much better day than yesterday. Um, which I think is just because Monday I just get immediately upset because one, I'm back at school after the weekend, and two, my German speaking lesson. Neither of those things happened today, so it was okay. I got an English essay back. I did really well. I got 98%. <laughs> um, and I got um, my drum evaluation back, which I didn't really do as well in. And the actual GCSE exam for the drama evaluation is tomorrow. So... <laughs> I need to revise that now and I've got a busy day tomorrow because I'm actually going for a college interview and obviously I've got my drama exam I will be able to vlog like after it but there's not going to be that much content the next two days because I've just got busy with loads of things but Thursday and Friday I should be able to vlog a lot more for this vlog hi guys welcome to vlogmas day 11 I am actually really glad that I chose to make this um, <clears throat> a vlog of the whole week from Monday to Friday because I haven't been finding that it's easy to vlog on school days particularly on days like today because I was actually extremely busy today after school as well it is 8 and I've just had my dinner which is actually pretty normal for a lot of people but I usually have my dinner quite a while before I usually have it at half 5, 6 time if you are wondering <laughs> but anyway you may be wondering why i'm wearing this preppy outfit with these little like ruffle trousers and this lace top reason is because i just had my college interview i've actually had a college interview before in, in october right at the beginning of october but this one is actually for the college that i most want to go to and it went really well it was just a pretty casual discussion about what I wanted to do there, what I wanted to get out of it, like what I wanted to do later on. So it was actually really useful. The lady who was speaking to me was really lovely and it was really nice to talk to her. So 
basically for the subjects that I want to do, I want to do English language, English literature and media studies and then for like a backup I want to have photography. So there's another thing which we get to do, um, we get to do enrichment which is basically just additional shorter courses which don't count for a grade but they're just good experience. Basically it was their idea of how to make their students stand out for other school against other schools and so for enrichment I want to do photography, journalism, magazine production, climate change studies, mindfulness and then there's a few others like green so like gardening and um, human rights. I'm very interested about that stuff but there's also one called the big questions and I was like that's gonna be so cool because it's like where do we come from like why do we exist that kind of thing. I've got homework to do tomorrow but today I'm focusing on getting ready for tomorrow's school day. I'm so excited for tomorrow because basically once a year at my school we do uh, this whole like Christmas thing so this is actually going to be my last one because I'm in my last year which is, I just realised which is kind of sad but basically um, <clears throat> each class will have a theme for Christmas in which they like for which they decorate the classroom and also <clears throat> dress up and we're doing silent night fever like Friday night fever so it's 70s to 90s party clothes and I don't really know like what I'm gonna wear I'm kind of gonna pick that out right now but what I also need to do today is wrap presents so I actually have one of my really good friends called Simran um, it was her birthday on November 12th but I still haven't given her a present and honestly I still haven't wrapped it because I don't have time but I actually got it months before her birthday but anyway I need to wrap that. I need to wrap a secret Santa present and then I also really want to write my Christmas cards. So that's what I need to do. I'm going to show you guys the presents. Also I just opened my advent calendar and I'm really excited because I got a body butter. This is called Sugar Crush and it contains shea, cocoa, nut, balm, lime, I don't know what the heck that is but almond oils and kiwi water juice. I don't know what that was. Kiwi water juice and this is just really exciting to me because I love body butters and body creams and all that skincare side of things. I want to point out to you, I don't actually know I can't tell because the camera is a bit far away but we have me and my dad have updated the firmware on my camera so the focus should be better but I don't know I will see you when I edit <laughs> um so the presents that I've got I got this gel lotion for the secret santa present which we're doing in our form I've also got her jack wills lip balms and i literally love the packaging of this because it's quite christmasy it's got fun and fruity berry bonbon and very vanilla and then the last thing i've got for her is this which is by sanctuary spa and it has a body lotion a body wash a bath soak and a hand cream and then one of those like actual scrubby things I'm kind of sad to give this away because I love the sound of the bottle, the tub, whatever. Like I actually think that would be such good ASMR. Anyway, I'm gonna keep going with that if I don't stop. And then for Simran. Um, so I don't even think I've ever actually used a Soap and Glory product, but I've got loads and I'm just very interested in skincare and I also just love the kind of aesthetic of Soap and Glory. I think it's very, like, in a way classic because it's got a lot of, like, black and white and traditional things, but I've got her this and until I got my calendar, I actually really wanted this. So it's got a dry shampoo, a facial wash, 
the Righteous Butter hand food and a shower gel and it also has a like face mask or eye mask something in the back but honestly I really wanted this and I would love that as a present obviously I have three of these things now so I wouldn't really like this as a present now but I love skincare so I think that would be great <laughs> And then I also got her this beauty blender, which is like the coolest thing ever. I'll show you. Yeah, the focus was so much better. And this is by Profusion Cosmetics. And I also have got her some heroes. Um, yeah, and then this is the wrapping paper. I think it's so cute. It's got like centers and trees on it. Even though it's the middle of winter, I'm gonna wear this dress because it's the closest thing I have to 70s fashion. Presents are wrapped. These are Simran's and then this one's Abby's. And now I'm gonna write Christmas cards. I've got this really cute little Santa feeding a reindeer. This one of like a little village. <laughs> And this one of Santa's sleigh above the houses. Good morning guys, welcome to Vlogmas Day 12. I'm in my Christmas outfit. I've got this Aztec jumpsuit play suit play suit romper i've got this red scrunchie this coat which is white i've got this santa's hat and black tights i've got the presents ready the cards ready and we're gonna have a really good day at school this is like the first day at school that actually makes me feel really christmasy because everybody gets festive everybody dresses up we have the sixth form pantomime to watch in the afternoon. We have the Christmas dinner as well as the dress up. So it's all going down. In our classroom. Well, okay. right in yeah. Yeah. I'll show you guys properly when everyone's left. I don't know if I can come. I don't know who well, can come. I can't come. Well, then I can't come. I can't come. Yeah, but you can come. I have a <laughs> You look really cute. I need to Oh, she looks kind of bougie. Like. Why does no one have a speaker? <laughs> God, they stole my speaker. I'm mm. just say what? Guys, anyway. I have no hand in no, no, Oh no, look at her Why is this zoomed in? Yeah. Okay, so 
I've been home for a little while now. I need to show you guys my, well, I want to show you guys my secret Santa present. But right now, I figured I'm actually going alone. I'm going to open my advent calendar for you guys. So, I missed a couple days doing this, like, on camera, just because I didn't really think, like, I just thought it might be a little bit repetitive. But I kind of want to do it because I think it's kind of exciting. So, number 12 today is this little one so i assume this is another bath bomb but i have no idea yeah it is sensational it says the same as last time so i feel like this is the exact same which is not bad at all because they're little but here we go so you guys today was actually a really good day and i want to clarify something because today obviously i got to show you a lot more of my school day than i have been able to in other days of vlogmas and i want to just explain um the fact that you know i was really happy and jolly and a lot of the time in videos i have said that i really don't like school okay i'm pretty sure i said to you in a video when i was talking about how i don't like school i'm pretty sure i said i like it sometimes and then sometimes i don't like it in general i don't like it at the moment but this week except monday has actually been a really good week and it has definitely been much better than the past couple of weeks slash months and that makes me really happy i made peace with somebody who i wasn't on speaking terms with um on monday and i really don't want to put it down to that because ultimately i don't actually think it's because of that one the main reason why i've been in such a bad mood in school has been because i really don't like my german speaking lesson and considering i don't have that for like another month because we're going to be off school i didn't need to like worry about it because i'm basically free for like a month and i don't have to do it like this week again or anything like that so i wasn't dreading something and also prissa helped me to remember as i said earlier on in this vlog um that people who are my true friends are going to appreciate me no matter what and anybody else i don't need so it's like actually it's okay i mean sometimes i feel really left out like i literally felt a bit disregarded today a little at times but and i think like it can be a really defeating thing but also i've kind of just realized that the people that i was scared might leave me i'm still scared that they might leave me but i feel slightly more secure that they won't leave me because i realized that actually they do care about me and that they do value me and aren't gonna want to toss me aside you know like they want me in their life and i've kind of realized that i'm actually pretty good and today was really good let me just tell you guys the school's roast dinner holy moly it is good it was brilliant i was kind of in love with it the panto was good um and you know being around my friends was really nice secret hand present i'm going to show you guys that now but i need to put my calendar away there's always gonna be another mountain always gonna want to make it more did you guys like my singing i hope you did hello the skincare drawer has multiplied a lot. This is what it looks like right now, but I've got this space to fill. I don't actually know who had me for Secret Santa, um, but whoever it was got me some skincare, so I was actually really happy. There are three body butters, raspberry and pomegranate frosted shea and avocado glazed clementine and grapefruit and then there is a hand butter which is coconut and vanilla hey guys i have to be really quiet but it's the end of the day and i wanted to say to you guys that today has actually been quite a good day and there were loads of moments where i was in the moment and 
just appreciating it so much because I knew that like I was going to leave this school and there are things that I will miss about it and this day every year is my favourite day of the school year because everyone gets so festive, everyone has so much fun and it's just a really like communal time, I love it and I had a really fun time today. I hope that you guys were able to see that through this vlog. I actually have got all my homework done, which means for the first time in like two months, I actually don't have any homework, which is really crazy. And yeah, so I'm proud of that. Um, I just got school tomorrow. I break up for Christmas tomorrow. Woo. Hey guys, good morning. Welcome to Vlogmas Day 13. I'm so excited today because I'm actually breaking up for the Christmas holidays, although I do feel like a weirdly a tiny bit sad because I had such a good day yesterday, but I'm gonna be grateful for this. I have been waiting for this for so long. I'm so excited to break up. I have a lot of revision to do this holiday, but that's okay because I'm gonna have fun too. I also just wanna make an additional note to what I said yesterday about why I think I've been enjoying school a little bit more. I've just been in a better mood generally because I haven't been getting as much homework, so I've had way more time after school, an actual proper break from school, and I'm a celeb isn't on, so I've been able to like wind down in the evenings more gradually. Therefore, I have slept better because I've also gotten to sleep naturally instead of going on my phone last thing or near to last thing. I've been like reading or writing instead as my actual last thing, and I have just slept so good. I've woken up from the best night's sleep, so I'm already in like a good mood to begin with, but now it's going to school. <laughs> well done. Yes, I'm on the lead. <laughs> Yay! I've broken up, guys! I'm off for Christmas and I don't have to go to school for like a month now. So, basically, <sighs> three weeks actually, but anyway. Um, me and my mum were just watching Pitch Perfect. It was really good. Now we're going to go out for a walk and going to walk the dog. And then after that, we're going to finish the movie. But I thought we would open the old advent calendar together because I haven't done it yet. I have a prediction. I reckon that number 13 today is going to be the righteous butter. I think, I believe it's a body butter, but I could be wrong. I've been wrong before. Let's see, it's not like pushing in. Oh, there we go. Ah, I was right! I was actually just about to say. <laughs> I was just about to say, if I get this right, I'm gonna be so proud, but I didn't say it because I thought I'd be wrong. But oh, I was actually right. <gasps> it's like actually like big. It is like the little vintage black and white thing, you know? And she's naked, so that's cool. <laughs> Guys, we're trying to catch up with the Ocado van that just went to our house. <laughs> I managed to get home. And I honestly feel so sick. Because I was running straight after I'd had my lunch. The energy I mustered to get off of the sofa to go and get this camera from where I left it at the front door was like... God dear, like, <laughs> and now I need to make my mother a cup of tea. Oh, look! Oh, look! You see what? I just got my autumn term short report and I was reading it with my mum. And short report is basically like there's no teacher's comments, it's just grades. And the lowest that I got in my milestones were sixes, and I actually got two nines, which is <laughs> crazy so I got a 9 in English Lit and a 9 in Math. I'm really proud of that so I thought I'd share. My expected grades, the lowest I have is 7. That's crazy. Let me know if you guys wanna want me to do um, any study videos or anything like that because I'm happy to do that. But right now though, what I am going to do is do two things that I have wanted to do for a really long time but haven't been able to do. Play Sims 4 
and read. It is now 20 past 6. I've had dinner. Um, it was pasta. And it was pretty nice. But to be honest, I literally had a cramp the whole time. Well, nearly the whole time. So it wasn't the best experience, but the food was good. <laughs> Uh, so I'm still playing Sims. I'm not going to play it for much longer because I do want to read and like spend a lot of downtime reading. But I want to show you guys my Sims game. This is the house. This, so this is my favourite family to play with. These guys are the Pearsons. Um, this is Eli. This is Alexandria. This is Josh. This is Harper. This is Samantha, this is Jasmine, this is Ariel, and this is the gorgeous dog, Toby. And so this is the house. We actually just moved into the house. It was not always like this. Um, well, it's the same lot, but I just changed the house. This house is actually from the gallery. But we've got this outdoor area, we've got this outdoor area. I put this stuff in. I don't know who this is. Random other sim in my garden. Um, oh my gosh, the moon is on the tapestry. Okay, so this is what it looks like downstairs. We've got this little doggy room. We've got, I also kind of furnished that minus the wallpaper. There's like this little sitting area, the kitchen and the bathroom and then there's the hallway. Upstairs we have the living room, a bedroom and another bedroom and then up here we've got the adult bedroom and then the kids room but I actually do need to make a change. I One thing I want to add is an easel because Alexandra paints and then I need to replace this and make put another one of these. It's a lot later than when I last vlogged and I played Sims for about half an hour to an hour longer after I last vlogged and then I got stuck into YouTube watching videos of this family who are like extreme Christians and they're like the most hated family in America you might have heard of them but they're part of like the Westboro like church community or something i don't even know but basically they're horrible and i found out that um, a couple of the girls ended up leaving the organization or like leaving the group um and one of the girls is called megan and she ended up like kind of fighting for equality becoming really compassionate making friends outside the church which she previously wasn't allowed to do and I feel very proud of her because that's a big thing to like, you know, go against your family um, when your family is so strongly opinionated like hers was. It's crazy. And I watched um, a TED talk by her and I also watched like some speeches from the Billboard Awards and some um, choir music because <laughs> I really adore choir music i think it is 
literally just so beautiful and pure in my ears it just oh, it's good it's good and I was listening to that and then I realized I better go get ready for bed now <laughs> like I'm tired and I have no reason to like stay up and also this week um like I told you I've been sleeping better and I have managed like oh my dreams I've just been so peaceful in my sleep and to be honest in the way in which I have to get up and just rush and get ready and then head off to school straight away means that I'm not actually able to sort of really process my dreams so I've only been remembering a little bit of each one every night and last night I dreamt that we had like an eight seater car and my brother was crying and he was also driving and then I was gonna drive but then I couldn't drive and I always have dreams that I drive and I have had a dream before where me and my brother have driven it's just always crazy but it's adventurous and I love it <laughs> um so yeah it was a it was like a good dream I think it was kind of weird but it was much longer as well but I only really remember that and yeah but anyway I had to rush out but because it's the weekend now well because it will be the weekend I will be waking up tomorrow morning and I will probably remember my dream more so because I will lie in and I will enjoy it and tomorrow I want to get a lot of editing done but as of this video this is the last day that I'm filming for this video so I need to edit this tomorrow. I don't know how long it's going to take me, but I know it's going to take me a really long time. Um, after I get ready for bed, I'm going to write my diary and then I'm going to read and I'm going to really try to finish my book. I only have like 20 pages left. I should be able to get it done, but I just need to get stuck into it. And that is my plan for the rest of the evening. Then I'm going to sleep and wake up and be refreshed and I will vlog another vlog for you guys tomorrow so yeah also the thing in the advent calendar tomorrow is really long so i'm really excited for it i have no idea what's gonna be i never have any idea what's gonna be but today was a guess um you know i should guess every time that would be kind of cool but yeah oh this time i literally have no idea what it is but anyway i'm gonna go thank you so much for watching this video guys um and thank you for your support i literally right now friday evening i have 98 subscribers i am two away from 100 that's crazy like what that's actually crazy because in comparison to other youtubers obviously it's not a lot but 100 people is actually a lot of people and most of them aren't people that i know because i haven't told that many people that i know about my youtube channel so i'm kind of mind blown but thank you for, for all your support always and i will see you in another vlog tomorrow bye